Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. As you're taking notes in OneNote, you can assign and send tasks directly to the Tasks section of Microsoft Outlook. For example, if you were taking notes in a meeting and a task you will have to accomplish in the future comes up, you can send the task directly to Outlook from the OneNote application. To use this feature, first enter a note that you want to set up as a task. So first, let's switch to a different section. We'll go to our meeting section by clicking that tab up in the notebook header. And then we'll go down into the notes section of this meeting that we created earlier and we'll create a quick note for a task that we want to set up. Now that we have our note entered and with that note active, click or tap the Home tab in the ribbon and then select the Outlook Tasks drop-down within the ribbon. It's this button right here that has the red flag at the top of it. Give that a click. Now the drop-down presents you with choices for assigning a date to the task. You can choose today, tomorrow, this week, next week, and also no date. Now clicking any of these choices will assign the task in Outlook instantaneously and it can be viewed there. But let's take a look at that drop-down, because you can also select the custom option right here. And then you can customize the task in Outlook in the task window that appears. Now if you're not sure how to work with tasks in Outlook, please refer to Teach you Comp Incorporated's course, Mastering Outlook Made Easy. Let's go ahead and close that for now. Now, when you assign a task in OneNote, a small red flag will appear to the left of the note letting you know it's been assigned as a task in Outlook. And If you hover your mouse over that flag, it will give you details of the task. For example, when it's assigned, the start date, due date, and so forth. If you wanted to delete a task, select the note and then click on the Outlook Tasks drop down in the ribbon again, and then you could click on Delete Outlook Task. There's one other option here, and that's Open Task in Outlook. And you can click that to open the task window, which is the same window you see when you choose to customize a task. Give that a click to close it. Now, when you open Outlook and look at your tasks, you'll see the tasks you've created from the OneNote application on the dates you chose. Let's go ahead and open Outlook and we're already in our tasks and you'll see right here is the task that we created. So you can then click to select the task and view its contents by double clicking on it to open that up in a new window. Now sometimes it will be presented as a OneNote link in the body of the task. You can then double click and open the link which will take you right back to the page and note which will be highlighted where the task was created. Or you can just click or tap the linked task notes button in the ribbon of Outlook to jump to the content in OneNote. And that's this button right here. Give it a click and you'll jump right to that particular task which will be highlighted in the OneNote application. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachyoucomp.com forward slash free.